Yo, what's up ladies and gents, and today we're going to talk about two different things. First of all, yesterday there was a silent change to the game. Logical Solutions posted that right now, whenever you increase your loyalty with traders, so the higher your standing is, like level 3, level 4 proper, etc., the more you're going to pay for repairing armor. And I don't quite like this change, simply because it doesn't make sense to me. If I have a better standing with traders, why am I supposed to pay more? How does this make any sense? Am I not supposed to pay less? I've done some tests yesterday. I broke some armors and we can quickly compare the price of repairing the armor versus the price of the armor kit. So armor kits come with 1200 hit points. So you can repair, let's say, Zabrala armor is going to take 150 points to repair. So we can use it nine times to repair Zabrala from zero to 85. Right now, the price of armor kits is 350k, which means uh, we divide 350 by 9, we get like what? Alright, on average, to repair Zabrella armor from 0 to 85 is gonna cost you 30, sorry, 40,000 rubles. 40,000 rubles. However, if we decide to choose mechanic, boom, 356,000 rubles. This is more expensive than buying a armor repair kit. This is insane. This is insane. Also, there is another option, we can sell Zabrara, Zabrala to the fence, right? We sell it to the fence, we get 100k, then we go to mechanic, level 3. And we can buy the Zabrala for 10k, so face control 50k, Aisa 110k. So 270k for a brand new Zabrala, minus 100k because we sell it to the fence, 170k to buy a brand new Zabrala. Or we can repair it with mechanic. For 360,000 rubles. Some armors are more expensive to repair, some armors are more, like cheaper to repair. Slick is uh, 230k. And we also tried uh, repairing Paka. I think Paka was 9,000 uh, rubles from uh, 30 points to 50-ish. So Paka is not that expensive. Yeah. So my advice, quickly go on the flea market and buy a couple of repair kits till they're not too expensive because i have a feeling bg is going to lower their spawn and they're going to go up in price so if they actually do this prepare to see the body armor break kits uh, being uh, around 1 1.2 million within the next uh, week or two second thing for today is nikita posted a meme on his uh, twitter page uh you can read it yourself but he's making jokes about players uh, wanting the game to be easy I guess, and on the other hand, he put a thinking, thinking smile. So he actually, so he actually might be thinking about making the game easier. Maybe, maybe making economy as not stressful as it is now. Maybe allowing more items on the flea market. I don't know what Nikita is thinking of. I'm not inside his head. But anyway, um, hopefully we're gonna get some updates soon. Not necessarily the content updates like Lightkeeper, but maybe updates in terms of uh, more items allowed on the flea market or some other changes in the game or economy. So, check out BG's Twitter, um, check out my socials as well, uh, links down in the description below, and uh, those are all the news I wanted to share for today. So, thanks so much for watching, have a wonderful day, and I'll see you in the next one.